Hey, what's up everybody? It's the Hyphen here. And today we're talking about the L Bracket 2 by Digital Photo. It's a universal L Bracket handle made for single-handed gimbals. And it not only helps create more stable footage, but also allows you to mount a wide variety of accessories, such as lights, monitors, and microphones. You can use this handle for gimbals that are made for cell phones, mirrorless cameras, or even larger cameras. Whether it's for the Smooth Q or for the Moza Air 2, this thing is universal and really does help a lot. Now, in order to attach this to a gimbal, the gimbal at the bottom needs to have a quarter 20 inch thread. At the bottom of the handle, you'll see there's a mounting screw. Go ahead and put that underneath and you start to screw it into the quarter 20 at the bottom of the gimbal. And whatever position you want it at, whether it's the back, side, or front, you can mount it, tighten it up, and you're good to go. And an awesome thing with this is that you're not losing that quarter inch 20 thread at the bottom by having this attached to your gimbal because at the bottom of the mounting screw, there's also a quarter 20. So you can still keep your mini tripod connected to your gimbal with this in the middle. So that way you can place it down whenever you want to. So let's talk a little bit about the build and construction of the L Bracket 2. Personally, I think it's constructed very well. It's made out of aluminum alloy. So it's very lightweight and very sturdy. It has a nice flat black finish on it. And it has a handle that feels pretty comfortable in my hand, though larger hands might not be able to fit all four fingers in the handle area, but you can easily just put your pinky down and then hold it with the three fingers on the handle and you can still hold it very comfortably. It looks professional, especially when paired with the gimbal. It doesn't distract or make it seem like it's something that's not supposed to be there. So what you get in the package is the L bracket with the mounting screw at the bottom, a cold shoe mount, a quarter 20 to quarter 20 inch screw, a bean grip with a quarter 20 inch screw on each side, a tightening screw for use with the cold shoe mount, an L wrench to tighten the tightening screw made for the cold shoe mount, and also a nice velvet bag to keep your handle safe from scratches. So the awesome thing about this bracket is that it actually has six different quarter inch 20 mounting threads on it. So you can put your accessories pretty much all over the handle. The cold shoe mount actually mounts onto a quarter 20 inch thread. So if you actually want the cold shoe mount to be in a different location than where it's already mounted on the handle, you can easily remove that with the wrench and actually put that on any of the other threads. Like I said, this does come with one quarter inch 20 to quarter inch 20 thread. So you can put that pretty much anywhere you want. And if you need extras of these or the bean grip, you can order the additional ones online. With all the different quarter inch 20 threaded mounts spaced out around the handle, you can actually mount quite a few accessories at the same time. So like I said earlier, you can actually have the handle in any direction mounted onto the gimbal. So my cinematographer, Amari, who helps me film a lot of my music videos, he actually prefers to have this at the back of the gimbal so that way he can hold it more steadily. Now for me, when I use it for event videography, I actually like to have the handle mounted in the front and I don't really use it for stability. I use it more for accessories mainly for use with a light. But really, you can use it however you like. This is really an awesome and versatile accessory that I think everybody should have if you use a gimbal. Whether you're shooting commercials, music videos, or events, I really think that the L Bracket 2 comes in handy. It retails for only 40 bucks, and I think it's definitely worth the price. I highly recommend it, and I do have links in the description where you can purchase it from Amazon. It doesn't change the price that you get it at, but it does help this channel. So thank you guys for watching. I greatly appreciate it. Drop a like on the video and a comment below if you have any questions, and please make sure to subscribe. I have a lot more videos coming soon. I'll catch you guys on the next one. Peace.